In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and a complete setup of your Canon Pixima TR7620A printer. So let's start with the unboxing. So it comes with the manual and uh, driver CD or DVD. There's the power cables, connecting cables, and the cartridges. Plug in the power cable. Press and hold the power button. Go to the screen. Select the language. and confirm it next is to start the print setup so click ok now we have to install the setup ink cartridges so there are five ink cartridges we get with this printer now you have to take the ink cartridges out of this packaging one by one open the seal from this side and remove this plastic packaging remove this orange cap so just push it like this repeat the process for all five ink cartridges and that's the black ink cartridge last one now open the ink chamber so you can lift it from one side there is a place to hold it lift it until it stops so it's going like this and press it down very easy it will make a sound and it will make a symbol on the screen once you install it you just have to slide it under that hood and then press it down so slide it in and then press it down close the ink chamber press it down until it goes completely Go to the printer screen. And it says the following ink has been installed properly. Click OK. Next is to start the alignment and also install the paper. So if you want you can do the alignment now or you can do it later. So I am going to do it later, perform later and click OK. Now click next, click next, agree with the terms and conditions and if you want to be part of survey you can do otherwise click no. Now the printer setup is complete, ready to copy, click next. Now we have to connect it with the computer so click ok. Before we go ahead, here you will see the main screen of the printer. Let's load the paper and then we will do the Wi-Fi setup. Lift this and slide it up, adjust the size, place the paper. Now go to the main screen and confirm the size of the paper. So that's a letter, plain paper, yes. Click OK. There is another paper tray that's at the bottom. So I'll show you that as well. That's the cassette paper tray. Now this printer has a cassette paper tray. So if you slide it out, 
can see. So if you don't want to use the rear, you can just use this one. Adjust the size. Place the pages here. Lift it. Adjust it up to the size. Now place it back. Slide it in. Now go to the screen and confirm the cassette. Go to the screen and confirm it. Cassette, yes. Next is to do the Wi Fi setup so that we can use it with any laptop or a computer. Select the setting icon or you can directly select the wireless button. So I'm going to show you through the setting. Device setting. Scroll down. LAN setting. Select Wi-Fi. Enable, disable Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi setup. Manual connect. Select the manual. That's easy. It will display the name of your Wi-Fi network. Select your Wi-Fi network. Enter password. Once we enter the password, click OK. Click OK. Fill the password. Connection is successful. It is connected to the Wi-Fi network. Now go to the home button. Now we have to install this printer in our Windows laptop. So go to the laptop screen. Go to the start button and click on the settings. Select Bluetooth and devices. Go to the printers and scanners. Select add printer. Select Canon Pixima TR6 100 series click add device so it has installed the printer what it says driver is unavailable that means we have to download the drivers now go to the web browser and type ij.start.canon and open this Select Canon official manuals, welcome. Click on the setup, start here. Type the model number that is TR76 a Select it and go. So that's our printer, click start. It is a first time setup. Yes, and connecting to a computer smartphone, that's the next step in that. So we will start with the first time setup. So we know we have completed few steps. If you scroll ahead, in the end you will get the drivers to download or you can directly go to the drivers. So click on the download. Open file. So that is the setup window. Click on the start setup. Next. Yes. Agree with the terms and conditions. Printer is connected to the Wi Fi. Yes. It says you are able to print from your computer. So click on the test print. Lift this section up so that it can print. So that is the windows test page so printer is working and it is connected so let's finish the setup in the windows screen click next next continue 
so setup is complete we can close the windows go to the start button select all apps look for the canon canon utilities here we have ij scan utility select it so this is our scanner from here we can start using this printer for scanning so i'm going to show you a test scan so this printer has a pdf tray that means we can scan using this tray so place the page here facing upwards like this and click on the scan document that's here Scan is finished. If you want, you can add more pages or you can click exit and it will open your scan page. You can see here. Now, if you want, you can just save it, go to the file, save as, and just save in the location you want. So, this way we can do the complete setup of this printer and we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning using our Windows 10 laptop. It's a very good printer for home use. You have a touch screen panel which you can use. The only thing is whenever you want to use this printer for printing, you have to lift this section up and when you are done, you can close it. And the good thing is like you have a cassette paper tray, so paper will not show up anywhere. You can store the paper there for printing and you can just leave it like this. And whenever you send a print command, it will start printing. And you can also scan multiple pages using the ADF tray on the top and once you use that it will save a lot of time or if you don't want to use that you can use the scanner vet that may be good for the passport or photos and this way we can do the complete setup thanks for watching